basically <laughs> purified water. Is that an advert? Is that an advert? Is that an advertisement? Go ahead. Yeah, but I can't I, I, I believe I do with that. You just had some. Come on. No, I, I had, I had, I had, I had I like good cases shit. delivered. You, you, you didn't have what it? What is this? What is that? It's regular water. But why is it basically purified water? That's what it's called. It's the brand. Are we live? Or more than a lot. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, I just wanted to go, so I had to get up. All right, you guys. We are <laughs> You're just bringing it in? Good morning. Um, Give them up. School's <laughs> out. It's for summer. Because me and my daughter's going right now. School's out for summer. Well, school starts for me next week. You going to summer school? Mm-hmm. That's all I guess you missed so much. Uh, this semester. <laughs> she missed a lot of school. Wow. I'm sorry. Nobody business. My, my, my fault for putting that out. But I am going back to New York State, though. How short was the bus that you took? <laughs> Shit, mine was a little longer than yours. Because yours is shorter. <laughs> that, that was good. That was good. Uh, well, um, we're here. We're having a good time. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? It's all right. All right. It's all right. What about you? What's going on with you? Um... In my brain right now, yeah. it's, it's literally just a monkey <laughs> doing this with the damn, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah. I just, it's been a, uh, I feel like my life is a, a sitcom. <laughs> it's a, sit, a sitcom, like a. It's a drama, parody, comedy, <laughs> You ain't never action. seen, you ain't never seen Malcolm in the Middle, you too young for that? No, I'm not too young for that. <laughs> You're just like the uh, Malcolm in the Middle. You know, sometimes, Everybody like, I will, in you know how, like, um, some crazy show happened to Malcolm and he'll look at the camera. <laughs> yeah, like, 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 are we serious? Here we are again. <laughs> I do that, bro. Literally. Like, I'll just you look, look at the camera. To the left. <laughs> no. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Seriously, man. Shit is nuts, bro. <sighs> it is nuts. So, um, I was on TMZ uh, oh, this week. <laughs> I was put on TMZ this week. That still plays? You said what? That still plays? <laughs> yes, but no, I was on TMZ. Dun, dun, dun. But no, when the nigga uploaded the video, he literally put TMZ. Like it was... It's not actual TMZ. Like it's like TMZ yeah. uh, <laughs> caught me on camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, Jesus Christ. Um, Yeah, but it was a huge incident. So how do you feel about it? Uh, how do I feel about yeah. it? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I don't feel very good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what what is it? I, I don't feel very good that I that we're just trying to enjoy a Monday night, uh, and you know people are trying to paint a narrative about a Monday night. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Let me see. Well, let me just say this. So let's go ahead. <laughs> Damn Bushman. <laughs> Damn Bushman. Damn Bushman. Make light of it. <laughs> Damn Bushman. Damn Bushman. Man. So. Let's let's go to Monday, right? So you you work somewhere, right? Mm-hmm. The, what type of establishment is that? It was a regular lounge. A lounge, right? Is it a strip African club? African lounge. An yeah. African. Is it a strip? It's not a strip club, right? No. There's not poles in there, correct? Wow. Okay. Interesting. So um, <laughs> so you know, whatever happened, and you 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 came to me on Monday, right? And you were like, oh, some two girls that were, they asked you. Could they sit, sit, sit but yeah, by us or whatever? And that happened, and this girl that went, and, you know, just made an innocent, um, seemingly innocent uh, Instagram story. And now people, somebody, I don't know who in the fuck, just screen recorded her story and then went and like, oh, look, it's a clip of me going like this, fanning myself because it's hot as hell in there. And now I'm a monster. I'm throwing money in the strip club. That's what they're saying. Oh, wow. Wow. That's I'm not even in the goddamn... He's not even in the camp, but they just know he's there. He's not even in the shot. I'm talking about I'm sitting here <laughs> dodging bullets <laughs> left and right, man. <laughs> he's not even in the shot. But you're there. Are you there? Or do you deny being there? Yes or no? Was he there? Oh, yeah. Were you there? <laughs> Pip, was he there? Do you remember? <laughs> Yeah, I was there. Man. There we go. He was he, there. He had a good I was there. T- he had a good time, I think. Um, definitely wasn't um, throwing ones at anybody, though, right? No, absolutely not. No, we, she's been paid to say that, right? <laughs> That's what I'm like. <laughs> to be honest with you, bro, there's not really... There's nothing, nothing that you could say that... Mm-hmm. Of course. But these 
people are just like weird and like I think they just want to be a fan. Yeah. Maybe that's the case. Yeah, that that happens. This is a cell phone. <laughs> Uh-huh. But a, a nigga will find a way. No, that's a detonation device. <laughs> You're trying to blow up a hospital. No, nah, like, like a nigga will just really make some shit up, bro. Yeah, I mean, it, it happened. And it's crazy. So, how, how long you been knowing us for, you think? About three to four? Yeah, about three, three to four. That's years crazy. Ago. Yeah, that's dope. She didn't came a long way from Jared Crickle to Ace. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You got a bleep. Huh? You bleep. No, it doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter. Okay. So, but in, in all the time, you know, like, I want to ask you, like, what was your, like, first impression? My first impression? Mm-hmm. That it was, like, a lot of y'all. <laughs> brothers. <laughs> brothers? <laughs> brothers? Did you brothers. get Did you get <laughs> that? Did you get the brothers vibe with me pretty quick? Yeah, when y'all, when y'all had that first, like... Coming together, yeah, we was kind of digging in there. Yeah. It was a lot of y'all. Uh-huh, yeah. oh, that's that was the first time. That yeah. wasn't the first time. That, that was, was the like second, second time. time. That was the second time. Yeah, yeah. yeah second. Time. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay, okay, okay. Yeah, it was, like, yeah. was a lot of y'all. It was a lot of y'all. That's what Florida. Y'all walked in. Mm, yeah. I remember that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. And y'all had the because I kept asking, "What is the shirt?" Uh huh. What's the shirt? What's on the shirt? With the fringes on it, right? Uh huh. Interesting. So you're like, okay, that's a lot of us. That's it. So you had. I just I just had a good vibe and okay. you know like if if it was like a situation and I told you about it you would like advise me on what to do mm-hmm. and it wasn't really any bad vibes from you like mm-hmm. y'all always chill mm-hmm. I never really had a bad situation nothing have you seen us do anything crazy in a nightclub before no <laughs> I mean, it's it's on, <laughs> except for <laughs> sleep. Oh, I mean, so I was tired that day. That's all, right? <laughs> That's about the extent of it. If somebody went to bed, <laughs> right? Bro, I just, y'all would just come in, mm-hmm. you know, buy drinks, and that was it. Mm. Do I drink? No. No. I, would, I bring you, 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 I bring you, I bring you, you Coca Cola every oh, time. I bring you a case of Coke. Coke. I bring you Cokes back to back. Mm-hmm. So, no, you don't drink. Wow. Yeah. I guess I'm what, what, just monsters. Do you and drink? <laughs> did, did, did he drink? <laughs> now that is like that. That's the real question. Um, you know what's crazy? <laughs> what? today. No, no. Listen, no, I, I'm take, I'm I'm laughing. But <laughs> I'm, um, literally yesterday I decided, like, you know what? I'm gonna just take a break from drinking. Oh, whoa, wait. Seriously? Yeah. Seriously. Seriously. You said that from last. No, I said that yesterday. <laughs> no, you did kind of say it last time. But, like, you mean it this time. Though. No, like, I'm just, I was, I don't know, bro. It's just, like, it's I'm just kind of being, need a break. yeah, bro, I'm just kind of not, it's not like I'm just being an alcoholic lately. It's just, can I keep, can I keep, can I, like, keep how many days? Sure, I'm just going to go for a little bit. Mm-hmm. I mean, I've gone, I mean, I, I've technically I've gone 11 years. <laughs> and so I turned 11. But, <laughs> nah, but since being a, a adult, uh, I mean, I didn't drink about a year and a half. It's just, I don't know, I'm just kind of sick of the drunk sensation or feeling. It's just mm-hmm. kind of no, you can do a little too much. Waking up in the morning and not feeling great. I mean, it's a little hangover. I think I think you said it because of the because <laughs> of what? Oh, the egg rolls, man. That he said, he said something happened with the egg rolls. Oh, oh, yeah, the egg, the egg rolls. The oxtail egg roll. That was horrible, you, man. I ate them. Did you? Something happen to you? No, nah, oh, nothing fine. happened to me. I was fine. Be honest with you, bro. <laughs> eight eight forty seven in the morning. I'm. On the toilet, bro. <laughs> and you're talking about on fire. Great. I was fine. I was fine. But that pasta, though, that was really good. Yeah, it was. It ain't the same, though, as the old It's one. not because th- that is just regular pasta compared to Rasta pasta. You're right. But it's good yeah, still. It's straight. I like it. You know, go to nightclubs, eat. Do we, like, harass women? No. Ah, that's crazy, right? <laughs> you know, because according to... Sh- I'm being told now that I was throwing money at um, girls twerking and all kind of madness. I'm you know? too afraid to harass women. <laughs> why? Why? This man. Explain that. No, one, one. Well, one. It's just not in me to harass somebody. Okay. But <laughs> two, it's like I don't even think I'd have the courage, the boldness to even do something just so like, hey, bitch, come here. You know what I mean? Like I can't even. How do you feel about the arm grab? I can't even do that. I hate it. 
I think but that's really wonder. that's really aggressive. Like I I hate it because it's like now if I turn around and slap you, you gonna be like because that's aggressive. Trying. Like that's like that's like a what is, what is it called a reflex? So like just a slap to somebody grab your arm. I try. I I do the tap. Oh, I ain't gonna lie, I hate a tap. Really? I, I don't know what oral is. I hate the gentle hands, the gentle. Hey, um, excuse me. Yeah, the gentle you know hand. I mean? The gentle hand, the palm. I mean, because sometimes you gotta be a little physical to get, if it's loud, somebody can't hear you. No? Yeah. Yeah. But the grabbing, but though. The, you walking by. <laughs> Hold on. You know what? Bring your. My mind. Get is over so here. <laughs> like, all the stuff people think that we do in the. I really wanna I wanna I wanna do like a parody. <laughs> like, I wanna go I wanna walk in there with like a fucking microphone and a pirate hat. You know what I'm saying? All right, what about like, a pirate just, hat? Just cause it's stupid. You know? <laughs> and just start like, hey, bitch. yelling at hey, people. Hey bitch. Twerk that shit, right. bitch. Like is that what you think goes on? They start throwing monopoly money or something. That's none of that happens, man. Like what do you niggas <laughs> think goes what are you guys talking about, man? It gets to that point where it's the okay, so where did you get this information? You, are you? Where is your Asian source? Society. Yeah, but you know somebody like no, you know but, people are saying this. Okay, yo, what, people? what people? Well, you know, I just thought. <laughs> I just thought. <laughs> no, no, and it was crazy. Is like, this is what killed me. Somebody went and screen recorded this girl's story. Like there was some top. I I was in there on my story. Like there's nothing top secret is going on. Like I'm, I, I'm, I don't know. It's people are just crazy. We have plenty of uh, pictures. Videos, paparazzi. You know, it's it's not. We're not. It, it was some paparazzi. It was some weird. Shit. It was crazy. Is you niggas wear tinfoil hats? <laughs> no, they do. They do. And no, and no, no. They just hated ass niggas. They wear tinfoil hats and the original three D glasses. I'm talking about the <laughs> the white ones. Yes, <laughs> that's what that's what the fuck I imagine that nigga. Man, if y'all wanted to invite, y'all could have just told me. You know, we could have we could have brought niggas out. I mean, that that it almost it's kind of given like a they hate from the outside of the club type of. They can't even get in. Can't get in, get in type of vibe. I could have did something. That's what Chris Brown said. <laughs> we saw somebody try to sneak in that night too, and it was a problem. Sneaking what? You remember the girls were trying to walk in? They were like, "Oh, we working, we working." They were trying to walk mm-hmm. through the through the uh through the other door. Oh. They tried to s- slick sneak in, but the motherfucking police just chased them down. Dang. It was a it was a whole thing. Yeah, excuse me, you know. <laughs> so yeah, uh, school man. Uh, you going back to school? What you what you looking to go back to school for? Well, I only have five classes left. I'm okay. a senior Georgia right State, now. Right. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm doing uh, kinesiology, exercise science. You know what's crazy? But I'm not gonna exercise. But you're not gonna. You don't. Do you have to though? No, but you. To be a trainer, like you have to look the part. You know what I thought about? I thought about a movie idea where it was a fat trainer. Funny. It's hilarious. But he was like a good trainer, but he's just like, I'll tell you what to do for you to get in shape. That doesn't mean I have to be in shape. Yeah, at the, end, he, at the end, he gets in shape. You have to show At him. the end, he should get in shape. Uh, it was a whole, I really had a whole movie about At that. the end, he should get in shape and then not be able to do any of the stuff. And But then when he gets fat again, he can do like 100 chin ups. Well, that would be good, but that wasn't the point of the movie. That's just something hilarious. Like, <laughs> go ahead. That, that would be funny, though. Like the movie, this is this is my concept for the movie. I don't know if people notice. I have a million movies. Movie. You see this head? Yeah. It has movies, yeah. right? Not dreams. <laughs> so, so uh, it was that it was gonna be a, a a fat dude that was a trainer. Yeah. And then he was gonna get a client that was like some rich guy's wife, and then she was gonna like talk him into kill, like make her fall in love or make him fall in love with her, and then try to talk him into killing her husband. Mm. But it's a comedy. Huh. I feel about that. It's like, it's random. Will you go see it, bro? You I see it. I got. I mean, it's just. You know how many I movies a, I got? I got a question. I'm about to submit some scripts. We got. If, a if you were in a movie, mm-hmm. what do you think your, the, the role you would play? I, mean, I could play whatever role. You, okay, so could you play Will Smith in Seven Pounds? No. So you can't play Will. Smith. <laughs> You're right. Okay. You're right. You, you see yourself on the action. You see yourself jumping out of windows. And no, shooting no, people. no, no. Action, please, please. <laughs> no, uh, I can do I can do action. I need a stunt double. Could you do a crying scene? <clears throat> yeah, I can. I can. You I, you know a girl can turn them on. <laughs> How many times have you just turned them on? A lot. <laughs> when I needed to. When you needed to. Listen. It actually saves me a lot. Can, can I be a real? I got a friend. I got I got a friend by the name. <laughs> That's all you. That's really all you have to do, though. Yeah, yeah, I know, like, I know. Bro, my my best friend, 
This nigga used to fake ride over girls so much. He had it perfect. I could. I. I the only times I try to force myself to cry to a girl, like you know what? It'll just this will this will be it right here. Let me turn this one off. Sorry. Um, this will be it. if I just cry right now. This is gonna change the whole. I can't. I can never bring myself to do it. So I can't do a crying scene though. You just gotta think about something sad. A movie, a sad movie you watched. Movie. Horrible. <laughs> it's almost there. Not, not you're trying to cry. <laughs> it's almost, <laughs> do y'all yeah. watch movies and like, do y'all cry? Y'all not I cry? have. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have to. What movie? Oh, I always cry. Like, it doesn't There's really a movie that made me cry hard as fuck. Are you though. one of them like. <laughs> I'm always crying. Have like, you seen? Have is, you, no, no. <laughs> and my my cousin would tell you this. Like she gets, she starts laughing to when she starts crying. Too, I like. want to see like what? Okay, what's a movie that'll make you cry? Bro, have you seen? Have you, you seen Love and Basketball? Mm, I think so. That's that. I don't, that don't make remember. You cry, man. Oh, shit, might make this motherfucker cry. Apparently, <laughs> anything's gonna make you cry. What's the What's the movie I'm thinking about? Birth of a Nation. Oh yeah, bro. I saw that two times in theaters. I cried the entire. Listen, from start. To finish of that movie. I'm trying to think what movie did I just Both watch? I cried at Seven Pounds. I didn't watch it. I pee though. my pants when I watched I Am Legend. Yeah. I love that movie. I hated it. And I peed my Why? Pants, bro. <laughs> Why'd you pissy? Well, how old were you? Probably like 11. Too old to be pissing yourself. I was scared, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. That's the one with um, Will Smith. Will Smith? Yeah. You were 11? Yeah, it was like 2009. Oh, that was like 2006. Oh, whenever, I remember whenever it came out, I peed Dang, my how pants. old was I? I remember he was he running. Was I was holding his hand, running through me. Yeah. <laughs> I was like 16, 17 when it came out. Yeah, it was like 2000. Whatever it was, nigga, I mean, shit. It, it was 2006, 7, like around right, there. Well, in the 60s. Nigga, piss his pants. There's what it is, bro. <laughs> no shame in my game, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, you was like. Nine. He was like nine. Though. He was like eight, nine. Yeah. nine. But he knew what PP was. So he. <laughs> he oh no, I knew. I knew it was, was body training. Training. You were that scared? <laughs> oh, I was scared. terrified. <laughs> the damn zombie. Absolutely terrified. I forgot what it was about. You I just, just know Will Smith. You think about Will Smith and zombies and Will Smith was the last nigga in the world on, on Earth. Care. This is that. This this brings up another conversation because mm. I think that what y'all just said mm. discredits Will Smith as an actor. What are you talking? I'll about? explain. We're talking about I Am Legend. All you can think about is what? Will Smith. What was his character's name? Mm. John. John Legend. <laughs> it wasn't John Legend? I, I, no! John Legend is a singer! <laughs> Remember the bit the doctor was cripping? It was the Alex Crippen virus. Oh, my God. Wait, so what was his name? I don't know. Tell me. Oh, um. He just searched it. Try to act like he remembered it. I cannot. Robert. Robert? His name was Robert. No, Robert it wasn't. Neville. Robert Neville. No, it was. No, it was. Dr. Neville. Yeah, Dr. What? Neville. What? You're right. Mm -hmm. How was it, Rob? See, but, see, no, but listen. This, this And this is what I'm saying. This takes away from Will Smith as an actor. Right. I'll explain. The guys who are the best actors, yeah. you remember their character's name. Okay. True. Not not them. These guys are good. Not not taking away like Martin Lawrence. What was Bernie Mac's name? In Bernie Dragon? Mac's one of them niggas. He's Bernie what was, Mac. What was Bernie Mac's He's name? He's Bernie Mac in every. What was Bernie Mac's name? I don't on know. Friday? I don't know. He's. It he, wasn't Bernie Mac. Yeah, I know. But he, th 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 and that's so my does point. That take away from Bernie Mac. Yes, that's my point. Oh wow. He's a good person and character. Hold on, you got You gotta understand my point. He's a good character as himself. He's not a good actor that can play a versatile role. What about Denzel Washington? Denzel's another one of them niggas, man. So, so, so Denzel can't play it? Uh, uh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Denzel is mostly a cop. What the fuck? No, he's not. He's Glory? Not. Is he a cop in Glory? No. Is he a cop in American Gangster? No. Is he a cop in... I said he's mostly a cop. Oh, that's... You anecdotally naming a, is a is few he, is ones. Is he a cop in The Great Glory. Debaters? Nah, hell nah. That's three. I'm three for three right now. You don't tell he's me. in 30 movies. I'm not, 40 no. movies. And he does Broadway. Is he a, cro is he a cop in... The Equalizer, one, two, or three. Yes, no, he's, he's a federal agent. That's not a cop. That's law enforcement. That's, a That's what I mean. Like any form of law enforcement. Okay, okay. Like he's 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 a cop most of the time, bro. His first like a, a Time to Kill, a fucking Ricochet, all them shits. I love Denzel. Don't get it twisted. Ricochet is one of my favorite movies of all. You know Ricochet? Malcolm X. 
No, he definitely got Malcolm X. I'm, I'm talking about that. He can play Malcolm X. He can play. Look at that. Look bro, at that range. He's Denzel, bro. Look at that. When range. you're watching that, you're not thinking about Malcolm. You're thinking about Denzel. Well, because he played it so well. He played Malcolm X and he played the nigga American Gangster. What was the other movie that was with? Uh, did it was like he was a superhero. Hancock. 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 That's such a good I like film. that. I don't like that movie though. Why not? Cause he had a white one. Well, it's just cause look at the principle of that. So uh, it was like a lesson. A, a lesson. Yeah, don't fuck with white women for sure. That's no, true. That's, that, okay. that's yeah, not a lesson. That is a lesson. No, yeah, listen. I'm, I'm, that, I don't, okay. No, no, no. But well, seriously, yeah, let me. No, 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 no. Literally, not even a. That was his weakness. Hold on, listen. It's true. You can't fuck with white women. Yeah. I'll explain though. Right. So I remember when I was. Chris Rock had a stand up. Never scared. And he said, when you start, when niggas start fucking white women, that's when things start going bad in their life, right? I remember I was like 16, 17, right? Boom. This is the motherfucker I know, Steve. Steve Ron. Steve Ron. From Mexico. Boom. So he used to be like, he lived in the apartments. We used to kick it or whatever. Boom. He had this white girlfriend, and she was bringing these white girls around, whatever. One of them liked them, whatever, whatever. Boom, boom. So we went over, my nigga, we went over to see, we went over to their house, right? One day. And... This is when I knew it was true. You, you Things go bad, right? Um, we went over to the house, and it was like clear the fuck on the other side of town. And of course, this is way before the advent of Uber, Uber Lyft, all these very convenient things that people you nowadays get to. You listen to the story. <laughs> you, gotta, you, you, you gotta listen to the story. So, um, we go over there, right? White bitches, whatever. And they didn't say it right. White hoes. <laughs> no, he's not said white bitch, whatever. No, let's say white hoes. No, so look, so look. So we go over there, whatever. We chilling. Everything is cool. All of a sudden, the girl who house we at, her brother comes in. He just comes in. He looks at us. He's like, hey, what's up? It's cool. Goes upstairs. Calls, Nobody calls his mom and dad. No, you know, he goes upstairs and tells his sister, why are there niggas in my house? What? Literally. You right? heard him? No, we didn't hear him. We find out about this later. So the girl come downstairs like, oh, yeah, my mom's coming home. Everybody has to go. Mind you, we're all in fucking high school, whatever. All right, cool. But mind you, we're on the other side. We got dropped off over here. We're on the other side of town. Remember my dude came? Um, it was me and him. We're on the other side of town, and they kicked Steve on, too. So we're Steve-o? walking. Steve Steve on. They called him Steve on. His name was Steve on. Okay. Right? So whatever. We, we leaving. We're on the other side of town. We don't know what to do, right? We call the cab. We call the taxi, nigga. How much is it wrong? You know, we jumped out on them. What you mean? Oh. We jumped out on them. Left them. We jumped out on them. I stayed in some apartments at the time. So we jumped out at the wrong, you know what I mean? And we go, whatever. But guess what happened in the midst of all that? Somebody broke in my house, stole my computer and my damn PS3, I think it was at the time. Yeah, that happened to me. God. So I said, look, I said, look. So I went to go, the one time I wanted to go mess with a white girl, I get my stuff stolen. Yeah. I get stranded on the side of the damn town. I or, said, oh, this is, this is, it, it's, it's them. It's, it, they're the problem. Or, <laughs> or, or, or what, or what? You jumped out that taxi, so. <laughs> so, yeah. now listen, listen. <laughs> no, car, but, but I got, I got part two though. Watch this. She ain't ready for part two. So maybe a little bit after that. Mm-hmm. My, my, um. My my little brother used to mess with this one girl, right? Oh, no. And she had an older homegirl who was on me, and um, white girl though, and um, she ended up going with my boy. Like like my my boy took my little brother to go mess with this broad, and she was there. I can't say what happened. I'll say that something happened between my homeboy and this girl that was supposed to be like on me, whatever. So my homie had pulled up on me and. It made me mad because he thought like he got, like got one up because he messed with this girl. I didn't really care. She was only whatever. I really wasn't. I didn't like she her like that. Fine. Yeah. Okay. So I, I, it just uh, offended me that nigga, you think you did something, but we had kind of started this. We had started a very negative and toxic thing. Right. Okay. It's called sniping. Have you heard of sniping before? Yeah. What's sniping? What you just basically taking it? Yeah, yeah, seeing, girl. yeah, like like I'm, we're, we're, everybody's trying to hit each other's work, right? Yeah. As long as it's not like main, as long as it's not your main. Yeah. And that was during time in high school. I wasn't having no main thing. I'm, I'm out here. It was, it was wife spot. Right? It's just disgusting. Yeah. 
How sick were we? Swipers. So he like, he like, damn, nigga, I sniped you. I'm like, oh, nigga, you keep saying this. No, you didn't. I'm like, oh, not this so I, it was making me mad. So we really got into it. We had, we stopped talking for like three weeks Final after that. Woman. So those were those were two times. Uh-huh. The only two times I ever even entertained a white woman, bad things happened. Yeah. So what does that what does that teach me? Stay your fucking from right. Yeah. right or wrong. Right, bro. Maybe I'll give me a nice oh, Nigerian girl. No, go ahead. You jumped, jumped out the cab. <laughs> yeah, I'm right, I We did jump out the cab. Go ahead. I broke a white girl's nose. <laughs> what? We can't, we can't promote violence. I'm no. Towards women. Just, just, what happened? I was like 12 years old. Did you punch her? No, I didn't punch her. What'd you do? It was a mistake. It was, um, you know, remember basketball off the easy? You throw it over some oh, no. I tried that, and I, <laughs> and I hit her nose, man. I'm just serious, bro. Was it on purpose? <sighs> kind of. No. What, what you didn't happened? know it was going to break her nose, though. You couldn't have known her nose was going to break. Nah, she started bleeding. Just, <laughs> um, Because, bro, this, um, she was a maggot, right? <laughs> right. So, I remember she was this white girl in fifth grade at uh, elementary school. Mm-hmm. Everybody thought she was the finest girl at the school, whatever. Mm-hmm. Right? So, oh, when yeah. I started dating she was blonde? her. blonde? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And, um, she had to be blonde. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I remember like the last week of school I started dating her. Mm-hmm. Oh, fifth you. grade. Oh, you was the nigga. I remember I, I asked her, nigga, I asked her to be my girlfriend on Gmail, mm-hmm. bro. You asked her to like, be your girlfriend hey, on Gmail? Like, hey, do you want to be my girlfriend? Question mark. <laughs> Y-A, yeah, sure. All right, cool. She nigga. said, yeah, that's what niggas were putting. Yeah, yeah. hello. And then she, then she said, yeah, I'm like, okay, cool. So what are you doing right now? Like, this, oh, this is weird stuff. Right? <laughs> These kids. Being you know? kids. And I remember, um, like, this is the weirdest stuff ever. There was, um... She had threw a party like a, going on in the middle school party. Mm-hmm. I don't know, and they did like Fear Factor there. She had this crazy ass house, so they had like worms and shit. And, like, like real worms? Like, yeah. <laughs> it was like a real crickets and shit. Like a that. real Fear Factor type deal. It wasn't like hella weird or hella real, but like little stuff. Was there elk testicles? <laughs> I don't recall. What? And if there was, I you wasn't never seen that all my kids. They were they were like, yeah, it's an elf testicles. Yeah. yeah anyway, you. she like. There was, like, this nigga who was two years older than me, a white boy. And she just, uh-huh. like, I guess decided to start dating him right there. Oh, she just left you. Yeah, right? She I'm chose. out of the house, though, right? She chose the game. Well, yeah. okay. So, um, I remember her mom announced, hey, to everybody, her, my daughter, Jaden, is single. <laughs> All right, she, she's single? Like, you like, damn, you supposed to be my girl. Yeah, so I ended up dating her best friend then. So then I asked oh, her best friend out. Real you know, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Should white, I applaud that? Another no? white, another, like, like, I mean, another, yeah, another, yeah. another white girl, right? So I remember, I mean, like, we were it not, was grass on it. He grew up with white people. We, were not, we were not cool, right, after uh-huh. that. Because like, you're kind of a maggot No, that. fuck you. You know what I'm saying? You're going to leave me for this? She's like, this her mom is like pronouncing that everybody at the party. Hey, my daughter's single, which means, in other words, hey, the bitch broke up with Dre. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's kind of like it was weird. Ah! I think it was racial. I think it was, and so no, I remember. Um, oh my racial. God. Yeah, dude, I feel like put. I feel like she told her mom that she was trying to break up with you because she was trying to talk to another dude, and then she's you know. I don't know what it was. You know what? That's probably it. And, and but then, I'm gonna play the race card. So we weren't cool or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. So, um, she would like then we had walking class literally in middle school. Like it was a class first period. Like you just go walk. Kind of would have been a good class. Literally, we would just walk to the store and come back. That's so a I class how they got an A. There was one time where we were walking, like we're not cool. So she tried to have like her little clique of friends, mm-hmm. like. Um, but she was you was with the best friend though. Yeah, but I wasn't. She wasn't in the class. Oh. Okay. So she was like uh, a, a white van had drove by, <laughs> and so she's like, uh, "Hey everybody, look that white van drove by. I hope Dre doesn't rape us." That's what she said. So, nigga, I started tripping. Like, what did you say, you ugly, you stupid bitch? Uh, bitch, I don't know. What you was. This is this great? Yeah, bro, I mm-hmm. called my dad. Like, yo, this fucking bitch called me. She's trying to... Oh, no, no, what happened is she she told her dad, like, I cursed her out for that. And so her dad called my dad. Mm-hmm. I mean, on the way to basketball practice, like, yo, your son's saying he's going to rape me. I don't fucking die. I've never seen my dad cursing. He's like, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> nigga, I was, like, stop the car. Motherfucker, where you at right now? Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> so I remember at school the next day, she's like on the little basketball court. I'm like, hey, Jaden, let's play one-on-one. So she's like, ah, okay, whatever, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what it felt like. So I'm like, okay, da 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 Bam! <laughs> Busted her shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Busted the shit. What's ah! wrong with you? You know what I mean? So, did that. Mm-hmm. And I remember um, 
This one said, I memorized back, a spinning backhand at a white woman in eighth grade. What? On purpose? This, no, this was totally on accident. <laughs> okay. As long as we're not advocating violence against women. I'm not at all. But I remember, I was, I, was I'm going to be honest with this situation. I liked this girl. So I'm trying to like impress her. Like I'm shadow boxing niggas. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm shadow boxing niggas, right? So I'm hey, like, man, this shit we used to do when we was young to like <laughs> show off <laughs> was so, hilarious. So I'm like trying to put combinations together, right? And so I'm like, yo, I'm like, Talia, that's a bitch name. I'm like, yo, what's up? Can you watch this? I try to do a spinning back face and like barely do that. So it's close to show like how much control Like she feels like you're a ninja. Bro, I'm talking about, and I did it as hard as I could. I'm talking about hard bro to where everybody in the hallway just went <gasps> I'll never forget and it was like time stopped as soon as my you're, you're, my you're hand, in a sitcom it, no literally as soon as <laughs> as soon as my my uh, back and my hand connected it was literally like everybody in the hall just stopped and stared and just went and I was waiting for the moment like like you, have you ever seen someone cry that like charges up that's like well you think okay maybe they're just holding their face in some pain but they're, they're just like Nigga, that's what it was, bro. And then, bro, we had we had class sitting next to each other right after that because oh it was in lunch. My God. And so she's not in class, and um, because she's in the nurse's office. She's in the nurse's With office, an ice nigga. Pack. Yes, bro. So I'm wearing the class, and it's, I mean, the teacher's like, "Hey, does anybody know where uh, Talia and Rory is? This little Mexican little bitch ass nigga." I told him, he's all right. You know what? He's, he was just a, was he trying to slide up on her though? No, nah, he was he, he was. Um, Teacher's back. He swung the other way, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. So okay. he was one of them that tried to be cool with the girls type nigga. Yeah, okay, okay. So um, she, Talia walks in and everybody's just staring at me. And she's got this red ass face with tears coming down her eyes with an ice pack on. And I'm honestly on some shit like... <laughs> so then a uh, the fucking teacher looks at her like, what the hell happened? And this faggot ass nigga, man... This nigga Rory goes, oh, nothing. Dre just slapped her. <laughs> I just said, I said, what? <laughs> oh, no, oh, nothing. Awful, man. Just, uh, I got so many more stories, man. White woman is not. Did you get in trouble? No, she didn't get me in trouble. She's not a snitch. She still liked it. She still liked on you? Oh, no, it was over with, dog. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it was. <laughs> no, I, at that school, I, had to, I had to leave that school, bro. Like why? why? You was getting too much hate. I was getting bullied, bro. But it wasn't like bullied to where I'm the victim. It's to where literally everybody at the school hated me, so I just embraced it. Like, no, 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 fuck hey, all hey, y'all. Hey. Listen, I'm telling you, this is what happened when you send your kids to white school and your kids ain't no hoes. That happened to me when I went to white school, sixth grade. That's how sixth grade was for me. Then sister, like I'm me. just a sister almost hated. fought me over her friends. Over like sent like over she don't even go to our school. But I was talking shit to Rory. I was like, matter of fact, tomorrow I'm whooping your ass at school. Like, you keep talking shit, da-da-da, tomorrow I'm beating you up. I'm beating you up. And then this white boy, Sage, I'm brodding in this. Because they was Sage? I'm whooping all three of your asses. Yes. I'm, like, I'm beating I shit. hate all of their names. I'm Rory, beating all Sage, of, all of you Brodick. are getting beat up. I hate them. Tomorrow. <laughs> so they get this girl, this sister, right? Her name is May Rohn. Mm -hmm. And um, she, she shot up heroin, right? So I remember. Wait, 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 wait! What? Yeah, bro. Graduation. How old are you? Thirteen. She shot up. Her heroin? and this white girl named Renee, uh, shot up heroin in the bathroom. She's she's a drug addict. She comes to school, right, talking shit to me. I don't know, bitch, go shoot some heroin. I'm I'm <laughs> immediately tripping because she messaged me on Facebook like, yo, you, I heard you talking shit to my friends. <laughs> Fuck you and your friends. What? I'm, I'm there getting beat up tomorrow. There's nothing. What are you gonna do about it? Come to the school. She came to school, right? So she's immediately, she starts picking up rocks. And she starts throwing them at me. Everybody starts recording me. Ha ha. You sure she's like, hey, look, I thought, why don't you be, what, are you, you going to beat up this girl? Uh, she started beat. Yeah, she started trying she to stop me. I start moving her hand away. Mm -hmm. And then my grandma was supposed to pick me up from school. So my like, grandma, you got to pick me up. Like, I'm at the store down the street. <laughs> Nigga, it was all bad, bro. Then it started fucking. What did you do, though? To her? Yeah. Nothing. I just was like, I just walked away, bro. I kind of, she kind of punked me out, bro. She marked me out. She marked you out. Like, she like, she what, she's like, what, what, what are you gonna do? She's like, what are you gonna do? Hit a girl? What are you gonna do? Hit a girl? Nah, I had no girl come get on. Nah, I didn't. I had a girl come get Cause on. Cause she called my bluff. She, I'm like, bitch, I'll slap the fuck out you. What are you gonna do? I'm a man. I it was never. That would never be in my heart. I just thought. Okay, she knew, you know she what? knew it though. She'll turn down. <laughs> She's like, nigga, what? Start throwing rocks at me. <laughs> so, I, so I'm like, I'm speed walking away. Like, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. And nigga, oh, God. she kept throwing rocks at me, bro. So 
public transport schools, nigga. Yeah, I hate it. Let's hear some of your fight stories. I didn't fight in high school. When did you start fighting? When you got grown? Probably, yeah. Cause I didn't, I didn't get in trouble for like, I didn't, I never fought. You know, like, yeah, I did fight and start fighting in college. In college, yeah. What, what were you fighting about? Stupid. It was all stupid. <laughs> Niggas. Here's my question. I'm going to go back no, a little bit. No, it was not. Was that over niggas? Are you sure? Positively. Have you ever fought over a nigga? No. Yep, let's move on. Okay. That was you lied to me. <laughs> How? Yeah, that, that was, he said that was you lied Fought, fist fought over? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh. Okay, wait. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, oh, wait, wait, oh. wait. See that? Ha! ha. Got it. Wait. Good job. Wait. There's context. Was it over I never a nigga? Fought, I never fought somebody like I, I wanted to like I cannot say. But you wanted to kill? <laughs> no, I didn't Ooh. fight any. I have not fought anybody. You had me. someone fight someone for you. All right. Um, no, that's all right. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> so, wait. So, you, you've never... Has somebody ever... Uh, I don't even know how they frame the question now. So, you've never fought over a male? Like, like somebody that I'm dating? Like Yeah, or like anything like that. Not like your brother. My brother is. <laughs> I have a follow-up you question. Are funny. <laughs> but no, I mean, I mean, I I did something crazy, but I never, I you never got tires. What's something crazy? No, I didn't smash. Broken window. No, she's not a tire slasher. I don't think so. She's not. It's not giving that. It's not giving tire slasher. Man, it's not giving. You don't remember the hashtag slash slayer? You said what? The hash slinging slash slayer. <laughs> no. Sponge, he, Spongebob reference. I, I, I might, you know what, what type of shit do you be doing though? Like, you what? into it, you're fighting your significant other? I just other? black out. I start yelling. Yelling? Do you break, do you? Are you a breaker of vases and lamps? And no. Plates? I'll probably like throw like, i probably throw something that I know is not damaging. What if a nigga got a PlayStation 5? I would not. Why would I do that? Why would I break something like well, that? Well, you said you black out. And like, why would you yeah, I'm yelling, and I'm hitting him. I'll probably hit him. Okay, so what, if, okay, what type of see. yelling? What type of stuff are you saying when you're yelling? Okay. Fuck you, okay, nigga. So you're, so you're yelling. You're, 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 what, what, what did she call the security nigga? Pussy ass. Pussy ass. Okay, so what if the guy? So what if the guy's like, hey, look, calm the fuck down. Who? Let's say the, the nigga that you're yelling blacking out. Says, calm the fuck down. What is that? What does that mean? I'm saying like, how how would I calm? How would I calm down if I'm mad? What if he just says calm down? What if he just puts you in a bear hug? Just... <laughs> that's probably the, that's probably the move, right, guy? What if just he bear calls? Hug. What if he I calls, think that's the only move. That what if he works? calls his sister, and Megan The Stallion is his sister, <laughs> or a woman of that? Well, stature. what happened? What happened when she went out to the? Would you? Cry? <laughs> No, man, that's just like it. Wow. Well, well, we don't know what happened. We don't know what happened, but she was not shot. What do you do if a woman of that stature fights you? How big is she though? She's, She's a big. Okay, She's no, because when she was dancing, when I watched the music video, she was dancing next to, I don't know if it was Cardi B or Nikki. I don't, oh. I don't know which one. Mm-hmm. But I don't, I don't even know why I just said they didn't even, just, they didn't even <laughs> like each other. But they're the same person. No. Um, she make yeah, Megs look. She looks big. She looks really tall. She looks like yeah, compared to they little asses. Hmm. Compared to they little asses, she looks. So that's what I'm trying to figure out how they dated. Who? Tori and her? Yeah, like sometimes how? they say the little niggas like the tall girls though. Tall, so tall girls, girls like the like little who? niggas. Oh, for real? Maybe, or maybe they know the short girls. Y'all don't want the short niggas, so they just gonna clean them up. You know? I, I guess. Right. So. So you slash tires? Hell, I'm a nigga. Why would I do that? I'm just beating niggas' ass. I'm Oh, it's a girl. What are you into with a girl? There's a reason I don't do that. Because I don't want nobody doing that to my stuff. Because I, I I, then I'll get, like, really violent. There's nothing a girl can do to me for me to slash her tires. I'm not I'm so saying cool. dude, sometimes dudes would do, like, crazy stuff. I might do it for stuff. fun. I might just, it's, I, it's I, funny. I, 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 I'd, like, I, slash your tires just I, to fuck with you. No, that's fucked up. You know because, what I did, though? Because my tires haven't slashed before. I took his, 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 his car keys. His? <laughs> no, not his. Oh. <laughs> I took his car keys and left. That's kind hey, of do, you, do you know I've done that before? How was that? You said it's what? Grimy. How is it grimy? I, I've did that in the last... It's Grand Theft Auto. You know. How no, it's not. No, it's not. The car is still there. You have to get a new... No, you have to get a new key. So if she would have stole his car, that still would have been Grand Theft Auto. You can't steal oh. somebody you know's car. 
If you know that car, that the best, the worst thing will give you is joyride. No, that's crazy. What? Yeah, that's the worst thing. What if he just denies? If you're like in a relationship with somebody and you leave, what if they take the car and Grand Theft Auto means like you really stole the car? This is some stranger. I don't know who you are. What if you? I don't know you. Man, come on. Who the fuck are you? You. I did that. I'll just show. I'll just show. I'll just show messages. It's not me. (laughs) Your number, nigga. We just took a picture together like two days ago. We was out to eat at a restaurant. Not me. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, you're going. You're going. You're definitely. You're going to jail because you're a liar. That's what is that called? It's something. False report? Mm-hmm. Found a false report. I've taken car keys, though. For sure. Give a fuck, too. I've taken I've broken the cell phone, though. That's the furthest I go. I don't think I do that either. I pay for the cell phone. I can't break it. You can break it. It's insurance. You can call insurance. And, I, and guess what? I went to jail for it. And do you know what? The, the It was a lesbian girl who processed me. She said, she called the cops because we broke the phone. I break phones all the time. You just get a new one. <laughs> That's why I knew Atlanta was a different type of place. When this is what the police are telling you. When they're processing you. How do you feel about Atlanta police? Much better than police than other places. What? I'm okay. Are you okay? Mm-hmm. <laughs> How do you feel about APD? Atlanta area, not even just Atlanta PD. Are they okay with you? Yeah. You should see the cops other places. You'll, you'll, you'll appreciate it. All of you, they're much better than us. What about you, Islam? I almost went to jail. I don't like it. He almost went to jail for what? Fighting. Oh, let's hear that story. Let's 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 delve into that. What, what, let's talk about what almost said you did. <laughs> Prison. <laughs> what would you be like in jail? That would be fucking hilarious. I can see her with two braids. Yep. Tripping. <laughs> you know, she just walking in, walking up to bitches. Yeah, I'm bitch, bitch first. You know what it is. Give no. me the damn, give me the soup. No, it would be a couple of noodles. What am I using the soap for? No, the soup, it's, it's a ramen. Oh. The ramen. Soup. They call it soup in jail, though. Give me the soup. You know it's three soups a week to live in here. I was drinking uh-huh. that night. Who are you drinking? I don't even remember. Y'all know, I know it's tequila. Mm-hmm. It was my friend's birthday. Okay. We went to Monaco. Okay. I know the place. Like Cheek? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, I've been in there. It was something going on in the car, all I can remember it, and it's just the backstory. It's not not bringing stuff up, okay, if you watch this. But, <laughs> um, we were uh, talking about something. I think we were talking about, I don't know what we were talking about, but she, start, she was getting on my nerves. Mm. And I kept telling her, like, just, you know, like, like I guess I, I don't want to talk about it no more or whatever. Mm-hmm. She kept talking about it, and she kept saying smart stuff. And then I tapped the girl, because it was four of us, and I tapped the girl next to me, and I'm like, see, you see, like, she's been talking or whatever. So we get there, and she just said, I remember we walked in a club, and my homeboy was in town. So we was walking to his section, and he was, like, tra- tapping her to, like, tap to tap me so I could turn around. And she turned around and started yelling at him, and then I turned around and started yelling at her. And I'm like, why are you, like, having a bad attitude, da 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 so she starts walking out the club, so I'm, now I'm following her, and I don't know why I followed her. I should have just sat back inside. Mm-hmm. So she, as I'm uh, trying to walk outside, my homegirl grabbed me, so now she's already in her car, so by the time I get out, she's at the light, so she's trying to drive off, and I open the door, and we get to fight again. Oh, you're on friends? Huh? You're on friends? Yeah. Wow. We're still friends. Y'all got to fight on Trinity at the light. Incredible. And that's when the police... I kept hearing them, but I didn't hear them. He kept saying, if you don't stop. Context for everybody that's watching. She was fighting where King Mine got killed. My friend just passed away over there, too. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. Somebody just died over there? The, the dude. Oh. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's crazy. I don't I'm like going to that spot. Not on yeah, that, that, I ain't gonna lie, that spot has <clears throat> got like a, it, yeah, like, feels yeah. some type of way when you go over there. I ain't even gonna lie it's to like you. It's like it's not supposed to be open. Yeah, I wondered that. Like, how is this motherfucker still open? Fuck. What's the hardest you ever hit somebody? <laughs> With any blunt object. <sighs> or fist. That's a good question. I think I just slapped the hardest before. You I slap? Love, I love slapping. You love slapping? You be slapping knees or boyfriends and stuff? 
You know what you need. Mm -hmm. You're a little like no. <laughs> she gets for I can, I'm already because she said I'll black out. I'll be hitting him and yelling. She, I, I, I'm seeing what she. Not wants. to like put bruises on them. But no, but like the little girl hits. Like the yeah. little girl hits. <laughs> what does that like, mean? Like you know when girls be doing this little slapping stuff to you. It's not. It don't really hurt. It's like annoying. I guess. Is that hard as I hit it? I don't know. Listen, I'm gonna tell you, let me think. We had Joe, my mom's boyfriend, right? A boyfriend she had back in the day. Like she had, we had, we had took my mom's car. I like took kids. We had took my mom's okay. car. Yeah, no, nah, I mean she we was old. We stayed with her motherfucking car, and um, we was out. It was probably like six, seven in the morning, and um, she called me crying. Oh my god, he dragged me across the floor. Some shit like that, right? Oh yeah, let's go with this nigga. So she said, "You did what?" She drug my he drug my mom across the floor, right? So. She set him up. We had her set him up. So we're like, Cole, tell him you finna pick him up. Pick, pick. Yeah, you finna pick him up. Where is he at? <laughs> so, nigga, she got the location. We went over there. The nigga said, man. He, what did he say? What did this motherfucker say when we got out of the car? He said something like, are y'all tripping or what? Like, he said something to that effect. Maybe not in that exact phrase, but we got to beating his motherfucking ass, right? <laughs> and then, look, my best friend. You remember my best friend? Mm -hmm. This nigga, um, listen, this nigga hit him. <laughs> look, look. Because we already had knocked him down, and we were stomping him out. I was stomping the nigga out. And he had got up. He had got up. We had, we had let off, and he got up. He was stomping with bro. <laughs> crow hop. You know the crow hop in baseball? Yes. Bro, the homie. Outfield, yes, yeah. the homie crow hop. <gasps> Boom! Caught him right here. I mean, that nigga went. I'm talking about hit the ground. Hard, nigga. And we were like, oh, shit. So, so, so we left, right? Bro, they talking about the police just found him. He was still asleep. 15 minutes later, he's still asleep. <laughs> they didn't pick him up off the ground. They want to charge us with assault with a deadly weapon. What? what deadly because weapon? in California, if three or more people fight one person, then it's assault with a deadly weapon automatically. Oh. We broke, like, his, it is. But it was only two of y'all. No, it was four of us. It was four of us. Me, Sliz, Keep the munchie. So yeah, it's not, whatever. That was I was I was eighteen. I might have been eighteen. So that was fucking forever ago. God, I'm older than a motherfucker, nigga. Eighteen was thirteen years ago, bro. Thirteen. Yeah. I'm old as fuck. You was eighteen yesterday. Anyway, so yeah, so uh, we beat the boy ass, whatever, whatever. Broke some, some shit in his face and fucking vertebrae, some shit. We fucked him. He was over. He was in the hospital. My mom called me. He died like a monster. You were just, I was like, no, we were fighting for what happened. We're grown now. When we fight people, it's going to hurt. It's not going to be like just a. What did you thought y'all was going to do? Shake him? Yeah, she, she, <laughs> she, she, she thought we was like, it was just going to beat him up. Like, yeah, was, but he dragged. He, he did something retarded. Yeah. So. And then get thinking, you know what she did? She went back to him. She said, well, I told him, the next time I'm going to whoop your ass, guess what? Guess who's not coming back? Mm -hmm. I'm not coming. You know, you can't continue to jeopardize my freedom. You know what I mean? But why do y'all always say that, though? What? I feel like men always say that. Why? What you mean? My homeboy said that to his sister. Well, like, if you're going to call me, you better not fuck with the nigga no more. That's all. If you're going to keep dealing with him and it happens, I mean, this will come with the nigga. The nigga, he's, he, he's into that. Usually. Right? Some girls, they don't learn. You know, you got me. I'm getting ready to go to prison. And you back. You going to be back fucking the nigga. What's the point? You might as well just, you know, deal with it, no? Yeah. Fuck. That's a fucked up thing, bro. What's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dude, he's kind of hitting him. He's thinking about thinking about some shit right now. Lord of Christ. Um, didn't mean to didn't mean to take it. Didn't didn't mean to take it that that uh that dark. But yeah, I don't know the hardest I didn't nigga, man. I I I didn't. There's something I'm not there's something I'm Me too, missing. I feel like I'm something I'm missing. I didn't I punched him out. Oh, no, the boy downtown. For real? When I punched him out of his fucking chain. That was the hardest? It had to be, bro. The hardest? I punched a nigga chain. How I many punched, fights y'all done got in? I punched a nigga through <laughs> yeah. the window. I punched like, a nigga through the window. I love it. I ain't been in a fight in a long time. Like, I'm not in fights all the time. Yeah. But I punched a nigga chain off. That that had to be. The way, because the way, we got to, <laughs> it's, it's on camera. And um, the way it hit, like, I didn't even know I hit him. But, yeah, the, when, when the nigga chain came off his neck, a side save his life that day, too. Yeah, the, Such a good brother. The hardest I think I ever punched a nigga was either when I accidentally punched Puerto Rican brother tooth out, or um, 
<laughs> what about the movie you was about to punch a nigga in CNN? No, that would have been the hardest punch you've ever CNN? Been. Listen, he tried to kill a nigga in CNN. Yeah. In George? Yes. Yeah. Um, hey, I want to ask her about somebody. <laughs> you don't want to ask her about? No. Oh, man. Um, let me remember. Pearl Energy? You know who that is? Have you ever heard that name before? Pearl Energy. Pearl Energy, no. <laughs> Who's I, punched, that? I punched my mom's boyfriend through a window, though. Yes, that was great. That's how I got my fucked up thumb. That's why you keep looking at it. Yeah, because everything you keep talking. Oh, my mom's abusive boyfriend. Who's Pearl Energy? She's this uh, fucking bum ass bitch. I'm sorry. No, I she deserves it. She's her. a man. No, you might know her like she's a real piece of garbage, though. One hundred percent. I'm not. I'm not gonna cut Pearl. What's she doing? I'm. Th- we're gonna tell you the story. We're gonna give you a good story. This fucking loser. She's a loser. Listen, she's a loser. Trust me. You don't need to. That nigga feel like God, man. Listen, so this is what happened, right? We're out teaching at CNN, and it's a Joel Osteen thing. So she's with some nigga looking at the Joel Osteen thing, right? So the nigga's talking to us, and she's like, come on. Like, she's trying to tell the nigga, like, let's go. And, um, but mind you, they just came out of Joel Osteen's church. Oh, so y'all are supposed to be Christians. Y'all already believe in the Bible, right? So I'm like, look, boom. You know, you, the Bible says you're supposed to listen to your, to your man, like, not. He, you ain't supposed to be like, let's go. You know what I'm saying? The nigga walks up on me like, yeah. you, you, I'm not finna have you. You know, he was like, he said something like, I'm gonna fire on you. I was like, what? Yeah. So I pushed him to get like, nigga, watch out. And then, and then the side just goes, I'm talking about, this nigga comes back <laughs> all the way back here. <laughs> no, I'm not and he, cause the way, cause the nigga's walking back towards me, Hassan get ready to kill him, bro. And the other brother push him from behind. So Hassan misses. Inside. No, I don't even get to swing. He yeah. put, I'm like this, and then a nigga push him, so I'm like, all right, and that's why I had to go around. Yeah, we ended up jumping this dude. Uh, Here we go. Beating him up pretty pretty good. Yeah, I, mean, I hit him once. You time. have the video? Yeah, why well, I got the video. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, not the whole video, but I have. Well, I have the whole video on my phone. I have to look for it, but I got what you're looking for. I just We just need that, please. Oh, shit. Look! 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 Look how far he's coming back. Look and look—it's the nigga right there. Hassan is trying to kill oh, that, that man. Where was the girl? Man, she, she was, was watching off him. to the side, not doing anything not for this thing. man. And we beat him up, right? This is the coldest part. We beat him up. He gets up off the ground. A ride for mine. He said, "A ride for mine." He's right? like, "Beat up." No, listen, 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 listen. And guess what? We, so, so somebody comes on our comment board after the video goes up. And it's like I know her. That's Pearl Energy. On Instagram, so we go to her Instagram, right? And the niggas not know. I'm like, damn, this your girl, nigga. The nigga is not no. She has not one acknowledgement of this person at all um, on her shit. So damn, nigga, you got beat up, stomped out over a right? girl that doesn't even. Uh, listen, I was so. This is so. <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> so I was so mad. I went over and grabbed the nigga, and then everybody like. Rushed behind me and, and basically tackled our helper. We all were on the ground. No, we both hit and him yeah, once. Yeah, and then I just got up and I just socked him in his both head, and bounced his head up off. Punch him in his forehead, punch him in his mouth. Yeah, it was good. It was that, that was good actually. That you was, remember she tried to sell, she tried to sell her fucking phone. She tried to sell her iPhone because Drake touched it for fifty thousand dollars. So she was at, in the front of the Drake concert. <laughs> she got the video of it. Look. And does not give it back. <laughs> That's all I'm thinking about. Like, what if I forgot who it was? Like, damn, exactly. somebody all like, like, shit. She thought that that was worth $50,000. I don't know who she's going to send it to. Drake touched it. fifty. Nigga, that phone is worth about five bucks more, nigga, if that. Because a nigga touched it. Touched it. Fuck out of here, bro. Come on, my nigga. Are you kidding me? But yeah, so that, that we, we I hit that nigga pretty hard, though, that day. Cause you can hear it, you can hear it. You can't see it because the yeah, camera's are away. Like you can hear that nigga getting thudded, nigga. Get behind this fucking phone. <laughs> the nigga shouldn't have tried me like that though. Behind this bitch, she only got a picture of you on her motherfucking Instagram. You gonna get beat down behind her? You know what's crazy? I don't think I've ever in my life like actually hit a nigga as hard as I possibly could. No. I've always like held no. back a little. No. Of course, you can't do that. Have you? Mm-mm. Well, but <laughs> why? All I've been hearing was fights. <laughs> it just turned this turned into a fight fight story. I got a lot of fights. I don't. You don't. You got how many fights you had? 
don't have a lot. It's not more than ten. For real? And you and some friends go fast. I mean, arguing, yeah. That don't come on. We all argue. You argue every night. <laughs> what happened the other night? Somebody was harassing you the other night. I seen him. Where? At the uh, at Devon's kitchen. I'm trying to think because I know exactly who you're talking about. Oh, at, on Friday? Uh, yeah. He um he was just hungry, that's all, but he was drunk. He had a whole bottle to himself, and he was just acting stupid. And he he was just, he just kept asking about um his food, and I just told him he got to back up because he was trying to walk in the kitchen. Mm-hmm. He was too close. <laughs> Not the nigga trying to walk in the kitchen. Hey, where's my food? <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even order no food. Are you? What? I was his server. And you had to break it to him, like, my nigga, you did not order no food. Mm-mm. This is the weed she was getting, right? The, the, the rent. I had a pocket excuse. You tell me. One to ten. <laughs> it's a ten. You know it. I just couldn't believe it. You got beat up for her? Her. How long ago was this? That was like three years. Three, like when we first got out here. It was pre-pandemic for sure. That was fun, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. No, we only had two fights. Not in my life. No, of course not. I, I don't I don't want violence, man. Um, but I'm prepared. 100%. But no. Always. Yeah, we can't we don't we don't want violence. Any closing messages for the people inside you wanna tell them that you just choose not violence? Yeah, we don't choose violence. Don't choose violence. Um we don't go to strip clubs. For sure not. Uh, I never been to one. I haven't been to one in God knows how long. There's so many things I want to say, but I won't say. Yeah, we won't. Yeah. Like, if I really wanted to, you know, deal with strippers, you know they'll come to your home, right? Then you ain't got to go to a club to see them. Good order. But we don't do that. Yeah, but we don't do that. Right? Why would I do that? Nuts. Right? We're, you agree? We're men You God. go to strip clubs? I haven't been to one in, like, years. Not your scene? Well, no, I... I was I was at what is that one called right next to my house? Where? It's your like, house. It's home. in like it's on Piedmont. I don't know what it's called. I oh, um, Onyx. Oh, I don't know. I only went there to get food. So. No, I know where that's at. It's in Buckhead, Piedmont, right? Yeah. But no, was, and and what you call it? I heard they got the best strip clubs got the best food. I I was just told that on Monday yeah. when I, I, I saw told somebody we can't go in there. Cheetah. Cheetah got the best. I know y'all heard about Cheetah. Yeah, I mean I've heard. They closed it down and they opened it back up. I listen to rap music, so I hear about strip clubs. That's all I know. I don't. I've never been to strip clubs. Is that cut? You cutting? Yeah, I'm cutting. Cutting shit off. No violence. No violence. For sure, no violence. But nigga. No violence. No I mean, but nigga, you know what I'm saying? No. You niggas can't get whooped on, nigga. Thank you.